Guys, we're here with Mr. Danny Demianenko after Canada's 3-1 loss to Argentina. Looks like you guys were running with them for a little bit, two and a half sets, and the wheels kind of fell off. Is that an accurate assessment? Uh, yeah, I would say that we uh, definitely lost our consistency uh, down the stretch. Uh, Argentina notoriously is known for keeping a very consistent level of play, uh, being able to play replay and kind of look for really good opportunities. Uh, our patient looks our patience looks like it started to wear a little bit thin. So uh, we're going to take it as a learning experience uh, moving forward, uh, and really to be kind of integrating some of their their uh, stuff into our toolkit. So uh, we're looking to improve upon this performance uh, going into tomorrow. What makes Argentina kind of our Achilles heel? They're so tough to play against. They always play us really tough. And of all the teams in the world, this is probably the team that we found the least success with. Um, what makes them so difficult? They're, they just have a level of patience that, uh, that is really incredible at the end of the day. Um, that and then they have a great setter, uh, DiCecco, he's absolutely nails. So um, combining those two things, it really, uh, really is challenging, um, but again, really comes down to patience. We were able to hang, out, hang around with them for a few sets. We need to be able to maintain a level of consistency and being able to kind of keep a level of composure and energy down the stretch uh, when, when the going gets tough. So that's, uh, I think we, we just need to work on those little things. What's it like for you as a middle going up against the Checo? It, it must be like one of the most mentally exhausting games to, to play when you're going up a guy, a guy like him. Uh, personally, yeah, it's, uh, it's definitely tough. Uh, it really, uh, you really don't want to get, uh, you really don't want to get fish hooked and uh, kind of pulled Burn, by, yeah. burned by some of his plays. So, it really comes down to being, uh, being really focused. Uh, definitely gonna have a good sleep tonight because uh, that definitely took some mental strain. What well, looking forward? What's next? Um, you got USA and then Germany on Saturday. What do you guys got to do to prepare for a USA team that's looking really, really good right now? Um. I think what we really need to do is just rest up. I think that really it comes down to us playing our game. Uh, I think we were able to kind of show that in our match against Cuba, show uh, a level of patience, composure, and uh, some really good ball. Um, going into this game against the States, we're going to have to do the same thing. So as long as we are able to focus on the things that we bring, not get bogged down and frustrated about uh, the, the tonight's performance, because there were definitely good things to pull from that. Uh, we'll watch video on ourselves, watch video on the opponent, and. Uh, and uh, we'll go to the lab and uh, get ready for tomorrow's match. For you yourself, you know, you were left off the and any of the weekly rosters last year for the VNL, mostly left off uh, any national team competition. What's it like to be back in the fold, back in the guys, starting matches in important situations? Oh, honestly, like, uh, I'm so happy to be back with the guys uh, at the end of the day. Um, playing on home turf is incredible. I've never had the chance to kind of play in Ottawa. First time, man. First time playing. Yeah, so uh, it's, it feels incredible to represent, uh, represent Canada, especially on home soil. So um, I feel incredibly lucky and incredibly grateful. And I just, I just love being out there with the guys. It's, uh, it's a great experience. Uh, playing with uh, guys like Steven Marr, too. Uh, Aren't you sick of playing with him, dude? No, no, You no, guys no. have been playing together since you were like 17 years old. Exactly. Oh, younger than that since we were 14. So uh, Really? Yeah, we played regional team back in the day. Oh, true, so, true, true, um, true. At yeah. the end of the day, like playing with these guys is incredible, and uh, to go to uh, go to battle with them against uh, some of the best teams in the world, uh, it's familiar territory, so we're gonna we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be battling through uh, through all kinds of stuff, and I think that uh, today was the first chapter of many, and uh, hopefully we end uh, end up uh, accomplishing our goals this summer. You and Stephen Mark all the way back to the red of Region Five days, right? So hey, Danny, always a pleasure. Appreciate Great it. match tonight. Best of luck tomorrow against the U.S. Thanks. Take care. Thanks, man.